Uh, my job role here is the local business manager. I deal with all the B2B sales of the cars and vans in the Citroen range. Um, what gives me most job satisfaction is uh, repeat business and when everything's lined up and the customer's happy, that's the main thing. I've been doing this for five and a half years now. Um, highlights are, you know, when you win a slightly larger contract for some in a public sector, or the most satisfying thing is when you just get repeat custom. When you've been doing it as long as I have, you get multiple customers coming back again and again, and recommendations, and it, you know, makes you feel good that you're doing something right, and people in the community know what you're doing. Uh, patience. Let the job come to you. Uh, you can't go into this job and expect it to appear straight away. Business buying is a different process and you know, you've just got to be able to answer all the little questions. The process takes time and it works and the business does come to you. Getting back out in the community, seeing the customers again, you know, it's for over a year now, it's been all over the phone and if you see them in here, it's with a mask or something like that. So it's going to be nice to actually go back out and show the product to the customers in the real world, especially now with EVs and things like that. Real world demonstrations are more and more important. Coffee. Countryside. Full English, beach, box set, night owl, uh, crying laughing face, uh, rather embarrassingly the X Factor final in 2012, uh, selling but, uh, TVs and washing machines. I've got a weird memory for stupid things like I can remember reg numbers from cars that I had years ago. Peugeot 306. Uh, range, charging and cost. Uh, total cost of ownership, more exact. You know, what's it going to cost them in compared to their diesel? Are they going to, is it going to be a worthwhile thing for them to do investing in an EV? Uh, what I'm driving now, C5 Aircross. Uh, well, it's two really. Um, a lot, not a lot of people realise that a lot of the Harry Potter stuff is actually based on around Exeter. Um, and one that a lot of people know is that Exeter is home to a European Championship rugby team, the Exeter Chiefs. I want to say the DS, I think that's right. Citroën.